like this is an interview with uh, Hinton. So, uh, for the people that don't know you, who are you and uh, where are you from? I'm Danny Hinton from Essex, I go by the rap name of Hinton. I'm a rap, gram, slash, hip hop artist, songwriter, and for those of you who don't know me, that's who I am. We got Maverick Productions for recording the interview. We got everyone that supported my music through 2012. New year, new start. Just big up every musician doing their thing right now. Right, how did uh, 2012 actually go for you then? I mean, 2012, I wouldn't change it, to be honest. I mean, it was a big learning curve for me. I've gained contact. I mean, I've gained a lot of support from people. As far as Nigeria that support me on a daily basis people in the UK and I mean I've got my following up north I mean I want to say a big thank you to them because they've been there since the day I started and I mean yeah 2012 went well I mean another got people that have helped my music in 2012 I'd like to say a big thank you to them such as NC who's been a big help to me and I mean he's got a lot coming in this year as well and yeah I mean 2012 was a good year and like I say I've acquired some contacts that I'll be working with very soon in 2030. Right, so what sort of things have you got planned for the new year then? I mean new year that like I say it's a new start I've got quite a lot of content that's built up that is ready to go I'm just waiting for videos etc and things like that I mean there's quite a number of things that I'll be working on and I would say next year averaging 20 to 30 collaborations with different artists varying from all different genres of music. Any specific ones you can name for us? I mean I've got uh, E-Screen which is from Reading which might be out before you even hear the interview but I very much doubt it. There's um, there's ML Viper which is from Leeds. There's another 3-4 artists from Leeds that I'll be working with and then there's artists in Birmingham, there's artists that are very close to me and then I'll be working with NC, Say So and there's just a few I mean I can't really name them all because I'll be here forever but it's just a rough idea of what you're going to get in 2013 and a lot of my stuff will be solo, I'll be working with some vocalists such as Michael Achilles which is he has got a very good voice and he's um, featured in my new song which will have a video and yeah so next year is looking good so far. Right any big names that you can uh, say that you've worked with over the last year or the beginning of this year? I mean I couldn't, I can't really call it worked with but I mean I went down to a video shoot with Mike Righteous's which is Ghost Town which I'll be featured in, I'll be in the video. <coughs> um, and as of yet there's not really any big artists that I've worked with, I mean I've got a few yeses for 2013 so whether they happen or not is I will let time tell, I mean it's something that I'd like to achieve to work with some bigger artists, it's great exposure and it's people that inspire me and things like that so yeah next year like I say it's looking quite good and if I can pull these collabs off with some bigger artists then hopefully my career in 2013 would advance a lot more. Right, so uh, what sort of artists are your influences? My influences, I would say my biggest influence right now and inspiration is coming from Mike Righteous. I mean, since the day I heard him up until now, I cannot put a fault in his work. And everything he seems to release is something that catches me and something that I want to listen to. And just something that make, gives me the kick to start writing. And I mean, there's many others. There's like, there's Professor Green. Like even as far as like Justin Bieber and things like that, they're all inspiring musicians in their own field. And I find a lot of people that are in the charts right now can spark off something when you're writing and things like that. But a lot of my influence is from underground rappers that have not even got a great exposure. But the way they write their things is to communicate with people through their music. And it seems that I can pick up on that. And like I say, it inspires me to do my music and whatever else but yeah my, some of my biggest inspirations is probably Mike Righteous, Akala, Pro Green, obviously Eminem is one that we all know and things like that and yeah they're just people that make me want to do music so, apart from me personally. So UK or US artists? Uh, I would say UK are my biggest inspiration at the moment and I mean I think UK are really starting to put themselves on the map now as far as music is concerned and there's there is so many good artists in the field and like I say respect to anyone that's doing their thing right now.
Right, so are there any new and upcoming tracks that we should look out for? Yeah, there'll be there'll be many in 2013. I mean, over this year, it's going to be quality over quantity, but you're still going to get a lot of material. I mean, coming out soon will be like Little Angel, which Michael Achilles is on, featured on. And then I'm currently working on an EP at the moment, which should be with you sort of halfway towards the end of the year. I've also got, there's Don't Judge, which is another song which will have a video, which is featuring Dan Mason. I'm sure you've heard of him before and some of my other stuff. There's also State of Society, which is just my song. So that, that's things I've got in the pipeline. And then there'll be Glass House. There'll be Back When I Was Young. And that, that's just a small taste of sort of what's, what you're going to get. And then obviously the EP is something that I want to spend time on, perfect. And just make sure it's what you want to hear. And obviously if you've got any requests on sort of what you want to hear or anything, then later on in this interview I'll give you my Twitter, I'll give you my Facebook, and you can address them to me and I'll see what I can do. Interview, are you an independent artist? Yeah, I mean, I am a solo artist as far as I can see it. I mean, I do work alongside people and work alongside teams and things like that but my music is personally mine and I do work on my own, I'm not part of any groups or band, I mean we are we have got a small group called Prophecy Media which is sort of like entertainment, music, video production and producing, I mean that's something you can check the channel out. I mean, and hopefully that's going to grow next year as well, and we can bring some artists in. So anyone looking for collaborations, for things like that, like I say, when I mention my Facebook, my Twitter, just make sure you holler me, and then we can sort something out. If I like what work you're doing, then of course, 2013, we can work together. Are there any artists on that group that you've already worked with? I mean, there is artists on that group that I've worked with. There's like Arcane, there's Optimist, and there's a, there's a, there's, a, there's quite a few artists, and then like Pippa Short, she'll be releasing stuff next year. Maybe Amber Manier. So yeah, it's it's mainly it's mainly vocalists and things like that. And I mean, there is a few other rappers that are up and coming. Like for example, my friend Little B. He's he's hasn't released anything yet, but he's got a lot in the pipeline, and I'm currently working on some stuff with him. So you you'll see some stuff from him soon. And yeah, there is, there is going to be a lot of things coming through this year, not just from me, but from many people I know, many artists, I mean, I'm sure people, you've heard of <clears throat> most of the names I've mentioned, like Mindless, ECG, there's Say So, M. ML, <clears throat> all the Yorkshire people, everyone from Leeds, and then also, also the people that I've worked with before and currently working with, just everyone's doing their thing, and there will be a lot through next year from everyone, I should imagine. So uh, what actually got you into music and writing I would, music? I would say that the first thing that got me into music was expression and to me music was a release like if I had something to say then I could I put it through the pen and into the paper and that was the best way that I could get it out and back last year and the year before last year was a big learning curve for me and the year before that it wasn't really seriously I was just writing there was no sort of recording side to my music but now as you know that I'm a recording artist and this year will be a recording and performing artist so I mean yeah the main thing that got me into music was expression right so cheers for the interview uh, just so everyone knows where can they find you they can find me on Facebook at Danny Hinton it's quite a distinctive profile picture on the front of the microphone you can follow me on Twitter at Hint of Music and tweet me on with any questions you may have. And then all my interviews, videos and freestyles are on my YouTube at www.youtube.com forward slash Hint of Music. I'll leave you with my emails. If you've got any questions regarding anything music related or media related, then feel free to email me and ask me any questions that you may want to know. And once again, big up everyone doing their thing and big up Maverick Productions for this interview, and that's all for now.